Hi guys, Wako here, aka Boy Genius and Theater Master. Acting is a skill most people are born with and some people just have to study for it. Earlier I called myself a genius, but you won't believe this. I was acting like a genius, that's why it was so believable. When I was younger, I would play with those green army toys and I wish you were there with me. The dialogue would be so impeccable and sometimes I would spice it up with some love scenes to really drive home my point. Now, were there any female army toys? No, that's when you have to become creative with your art. A good actor knows when to go over and beyond at the right time and that's what makes them better than the rest. You see right here, this guy is unique because in the midst of everybody fighting, he still had to withdraw. That was written in his script and that is how you know a good actor. It's so hard to find good actors without ripping them off. It's either you pay so much to get the very best in your movie or you pay less with the added bonus of exposure and pray to God that your movie gets picked up in a bar. Don't worry about the bill, I'll take care of it. Hey! You all know I'm the boss, right? You know you all know I'm the boss, right? You all know I'm the boss, right? How about if I give you some money for you to keep it up? You all know I'm the boss, right? A good actor is able to make the audience forget they are watching a movie, but with the added bonus that the writers make them believable. Aminu is a faithful rich man in Lagos that is able to stand temptation from one of the finest babes in the world. Come on, guys! That story is not grounded in reality. Critics love to say Nigerian actors are bad, but they are the same people who would share videos of Gary V because they bought a coin yesterday night. So don't listen to them. I love the most in the world. My family. Once a day, genuinely sit there for five minutes and make pretend one of them got shot in the face. <laughs> Improv will always be the greatest tool in old Nollywood. This was when the director and the writer would raise their two hands up and go, figure it out. Opportunity come up at once. See, see. I don't use my opportunity. Don't worry. Funny actors back then would be given a rough draft of where the scene would be headed to with little jokes and the actors had to magically figure it out as it goes. And that was why it felt so organic but sometimes confusing. Uh, he has been overseas for a long time. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay. That's the way they say over here. <laughs> He's been in America for a very long time. Okay. Yes, he just came back. My for friend. this issue of this local government you talked about, what I do is to move from here in the morning, go to my office and sign and go. <laughs> inspector <laughs> or no inspector, sign and go home. Legends in the industry were good at nailing this skill so well that the new era adapted it. Rich Trigger Moments is known for having more improv than actual written scenes. I just saw Justin with another woman stepping out of a hotel and from what I saw, they are dating. Every bar scene in the men's club is a perfect example of improv. But was it perfect? No. I hope the people inside the VIP are ready to pay VIP money. Of course, what wait, are you wait, talking wait, about, wait, man? We, pay, we, we, we pick our bills, man. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Sweat and blood is in this building. Uh, <laughs> you don't have to pay your nothing. Life. <laughs> so we have to pay nothing. Well, guys, um, <laughs> now, let me show you a better improvised scene. I don't want noodles, please. I don't want noodles. I want something good. I already had a long day. I want white rice and sauce that's what i want i read this whole movie was an improv no director no script just the cameraman and vibes laughing has to be the most organic thing to fake but it is surprisingly the one thing people know how to do very well you see one person faking a laugh in the movie can be easy but when you add another character or multiple characters in the mist th that's a recipe for disaster <laughs> None would have been as sweet as him. Hey, he's so sweet. I can imagine. <laughs> I had fun with him. It was. Method actors are the cream de la cream in act. It's where actors leave the role and truly believe they are the person they are portraying in the movie. The funny thing is, every actor in Nigeria would believe they are doing method acting. But they are not. Joker is a method actor. Shola Shobo Ale is definitely a method actor. This guy here is a method actor. 
he really wanted his money. Method acting is like a babe that has been dating a guy for 10 years. They have imagined getting married to him, but until the day he gets on his knees, you will still see them act like they did not see it coming. That's what method acting is. Anger and accent is like the final boss in acting. For years, actors have trained themselves to bring unique accents to depict their roles better. A lot of people hate it and a lot of people don't even notice it at all. And I call it dedication because if you know a lot of people hate something and you keep doing that same thing, dedication, guys. I should be the one proposing to you and not the other way around. You call him fiancé? Oh goodness. Creating a new accent for a role is easy, but when it's time to show anger, you really want the right energy. If they are too angry, the mic would suffer for sure. Both of you can go to hell! You won't do anything! No! He don't love me! Don't tell me that! What's love without trust? So the solution is this, you either go overboard or you don't act at all. I said I'm sorry. I'm hey, sorry. Keep your key. You're sorry. That's it, it's not me. You shut up. Shut up. You stand before me and you tell me that it wasn't you. Fuck it. Murdered in cold blood. Acting isn't easy and to stand out of the crowd is hard and actors should be given credit for even trying. The good and the bad. So let's end this video with the best scene ever made by man. Uh, uh, unnecessary for me. You know, she really does know how to piece me up. Piece me up. Nice.